What's up, everybody? I'm Tylock, and this is Homespun Geek. So what the heck is going on in this video right here? Uh, I've got a bunch of things that I want to do. Uh, and I was going to do several, several videos, make them separate, and then I was like, hey, why not just throw it all into one? So there's three primary aspects to this video. One is... I want to thank some people. Two is, I'm going to open this Ferrera box right here. And three is, I'm going to let you know what you need to do to win the 400 subscriber giveaway, uh, which includes this little owl right here. Uh, I'll also let you know, of course, what pop is in that giveaway as well. Sorry, I was looking across the camera over here because he's over there somewhere. Um, but I'll definitely let you know what pop is in there. And then there's something else right here. Uh, that I'm going to tell you what's going on with that at the end of the video, guys. But before we get started, guys, if you have not already subscribed, smash that red button, guys. Please subscribe to Homespun Geek. I've got many more videos to come. I post three to four videos a week. Uh, lots of just random stuff, some mystery boxes. I've got some mystery mystery uh, M3 Toys bo uh, box. I've got a new mystery toys box from M3 Toys. Um, coming soon. I've got some box swaps, some unboxings, some loot crates, some um, subscription boxes, lots of Funko Pops as you can see over here. Um, hit the subscribe guys. You'll see all that coming up in the future. Uh, if you like this video, if you like my content, please click the thumbs up below guys. Let me know that you like this and if you have anything to say, anything at all, please guys don't hesitate to comment below whatever you think. Let me know about what you think about the things in this video or what you think about anything. What's the best movie you've seen recently? What are you going to do for Thanksgiving? What are you going to do for Christmas? What are you hoping to get for Christmas? So guys, uh, anyway, that's all I want to say there. Now let me move on to the, what is basically the first part of this video, and that is thank yous. Uh, I did hit 400 subscribers. As I just said, I'm going to do the giveaway uh, this week sometime. I'm going to tell you how to do it today and then probably do it in the next week. Um, but guys, I didn't do it without help. I did it with a tremendous amount of help. Um, from first and foremost, I just want to say uh, to two people who are really amazing, really great people, uh, Nerdy Treasures, JC at Nerdy Treasures. I'm going to put a link to him in the description below, guys. You should go follow him if you're not. He's trying to get to 1,000 subscribers. He's very close. Less than 100 away. I think he's actually less than 70 or 80 away. Um, guys, that would really help him out a lot if you help him get to 1,000 subscribers. Because you all know, the more you have, the better we grow. Uh, so, the other group, guys, I want to thank is the Pop Couple. The Pop Couple was so generous in hosting our live stream the other night. Um, if you haven't watched that live stream, guys, you can go over to the Pop Couple's channel. I'll put the link to that video below. Uh, and watch that live stream where we did tons of giveaways um a lot of people were there it was very fun very awesome my first live stream uh and i'm thankful to share my first live stream with some of my friends that i've made on uh youtube over the last few months uh, but uh i want to thank the pop couple very much for for hosting that second half of that live stream jc at nerdy treasures for hosting the first half uh and i want to thank everybody that was willing to contribute and help me get to 400 uh, I don't know. I'm sure there's going to be names I'm going to leave out. It's not because I forget you. For I mean, it's just because I'm forgetting. Uh, but Emstad, Cheap and Nerdy, Lady Dazed, Funko Nerd Stark, Alex Lopez, Robert Breaks YouTube Adventures, uh, Funko Pop Ohana. Uh, there's a lot of people who helped us get to 400, and I say us because it was me and Robert Breaks YouTube Adventures. Uh, a lot of people helped us. If I didn't say your name, I, I thank you as well. Uh, I just can't think of all the names right now off the top of my head because, there, like I said, there were a lot of people uh, that helped out quite a bit. And I appreciate every single one of you completely, absolutely appreciate it. So uh, with that, guys, let's move on to the second part of this, which is this Ferrera box right here. Now you'll notice my partner in crime, Cherie, is not here right now. She is almost always, or has always been here. Actually, I don't think she was in the first Ferrera box, even though it was Disney themed, so. 
She should have been in that one. But she's been in every everyone since then. She's not here right now because she's out of town. She's with her family in the Houston area. Uh, and uh, so I'm riding solo on this Ferrer box, which is okay. Uh, she deserves some time with her family. And I enjoy my time alone, to be honest with you. Uh, and she had no real interest in this box, guys. She, bought, she buys this box, but she primarily bought this box for me because the theme is anime. And even though there are some animes that Sheree likes, for example, Death Note and, uh, oh shoot, I just went, my mind just went blank. Oh, Totoro. She really likes Totoro. She really likes Death Note. She really likes Full Metal Alchemist. Uh, we watched that one together. Uh, a lot of the other animes she really doesn't have a giant interest in, even though she is enjoying Attack on Titan with me as we're watching through it right now. Uh, I have no idea what's going to be in this, this box. I have completely avoided even watching other people's videos. Even though, if you don't know, for Rare Box is different for everyone. They put different things in every box. And this for Rare Box seems a little bit bigger than some of the past ones. So I'm hoping there's something awesome in here, guys. Uh, but with that said, guys, found the zombie killer. Look at that. I know last video I had to use scissors because I couldn't find this stinking knife. But here he is, guys. Uh, let's see, where do you cut here? Here you go. For our box, is a very plain box, as I've said, which is absolutely okay because it helps everyone cut prices. If the, if the only thing you're spending money on is this awesome tape right here that says for rare box, uh, then you can cut prices and you can put more in a box. You know, you don't have to spend money putting fancy decorations on this box. Uh, just give people more stuff in the box, which they do, guys. This box is $20 a month. Uh, there's usually at least one or two pops in there, which is equal to $22 or $20 right there. Um, I'm going to open this facing you guys, let you see what is in there. Uh, and I'll put a link in the description below to the ferrerabox.com. Uh, their website, I believe, is either the ferrerabox.com or just ferrerabox.com, guys. But I'll figure it out and I'll put that link in the description below so you guys can go check them out because 20 bucks a month, pretty good deal. If you like anime, this was a good month. Uh, last month, I believe, was horror. We've also done Disney. Um, we've had some pretty good luck with the Ferrer boxes. So uh, here we go, guys. This is what is in this box oh man is it just brown paper of course all right let me pull this paper out there you go that's what is in this box guys here you go hopefully it's something cool uh before i go into this though let me close this i know a lot of animes i do watch a lot of animes but specifically i watch dragon ball z one piece um attack on titan naruto um full metal alchemist I tried to watch Death Note with Sheree. That's not my thing. Sorry, guys. Uh, tried to watch Death Note. Didn't really enjoy Death Note that much. Uh, we tried to watch Fairy Tale, which I was enjoying, but Sheree wasn't, so didn't really continue on with that one. But anyway, I know my I know a lot of the Funko stuff right now with uh, for with Funko uh, anime is uh, Tokyo Ghoul. I don't know anything about Tokyo Ghoul. My Hero Academia. I don't know anything about My Hero Academia. Uh, so hopefully there's at least some stuff in here that I'm familiar with. But whatever's in here, I don't care. It's still cool to get stuff. So uh, let's open this up. All right. Here's something smaller. What is this? This is a... Okay. <laughs> this is a Sailor Moon Mystery Mini. Uh, Sailor Moon, I think, was around in the 80s or at least early 90s. So you'd think I'd be familiar with it, but... I am not. So I'm going to go ahead and open this. I know that I have a friend on YouTube, Miss Funko Pops and Unicorns, who likes Sailor Moon, especially the Mystery Mini. So, Caitlin, if you're watching this, let me know in the comments below if this is something you don't have, and I will gladly send it your way. Um, but probably will be something that you already have. So, But uh, just in case it is, just let me know. I know everybody wanted the cats. It does not feel like it is a cat. But everybody that I've seen open these wanted the cats, and I haven't actually seen anybody get any of the cats. So, uh, this is a uh, little dark haired girl. Don't know. Let's see. Does it have her names on here? Oh, well, this is at least a 1 in 12. Oh, wait. Hold on. Am I right? Yeah, it's 1 in 12. I don't know who that is. 
but Caitlin, if you don't have her, let me know, and she'll head your way. Um, so there is that. Mystery minis typically, guys, are anywhere from five to ten dollars. So this is a twenty dollar box. So there's at least five dollars worth of uh, money back there, right? Let's see what's next. Here's something here. Oh, <laughs> Ugh. I like it when I get cool stuff. Oh, you guys, this is a fig pen of Goku, Super Saiyan God Goku. Uh, I have seen fig pens at Target, Hot Topic, many different places. I have not bought one yet, but I really like pens, and I really like this nerdy stuff. These pens are super cool. Um, that was weird. Oh, that's so, that's cool. All right, guys, and uh, oh, this is, it comes in a little display case. Did you guys know that? I guess you can even put this bottom back on and just display it like that. So if you buy big pins, guys, and you don't want to just take them out and pin them to something, you can actually just display it like that. So like I said, Dragon Ball Z is definitely one that I'm familiar with. Uh, I haven't watched much of Super, but I do know what it is. Uh, there is Super Saiyan God Goku. Uh, I'm trying to figure out how you get it out of there. Oh, I guess you just have to slide it out. There you go. There you go. I'm not going to take him off the clasp here, guys. Uh, no, I'm not because I'm not even going to figure that out. But anyway, there is the pin. Super Saiyan God Goku. That's cool, cool, cool. Hopefully there's not a massive amount of glare on that and you can see it. Um... I'll turn it that way just in case it helps light it. Uh, but that is it, guys. Uh, that was cool. That was a cool one. Uh, so at least there's one thing in here that I really enjoy. That's what, all that really matters. Right, guys? Uh, heck, I'll just leave it like that. Uh, all right. Let me close this because I don't think I need that anymore. The fig pin thing I can toss. I may put his background. This was... The, the other side of this, guys, it is just a picture of him as in the Super Saiyan God form. Dragon Ball Fighter Z is what it says there. But awesome, awesome pin. I like it a lot. There's something soft here. <laughs> yes! Uh, I was so worried there's going to be a bunch of stuff in here I don't know anything about. This is uh, socks, guys. This is Naruto socks. Uh, Naruto, I have completely watched the first Naruto series uh, from beginning to end. I have not watched Shippuden. I've watched a little bit of Shippuden, but not really delved into it. Uh, but that is awesome. Naruto socks. I will definitely wear these socks. As I said in previous videos, I will <laughs> I will wear these socks, just probably not with shorts and sandals, you know, guys? No, don't do that. All right, the next thing is... Oh, man. Feels like there's two pops in here. Pretty sure there's two pops. Let's see, this one is... Oh, there you go. This is what I was thinking here. Uh, Deku Training from My Hero Academia. Uh, don't know anything about My Hero Academia. Should I watch it? I'm sure people have seen this. Should I watch My Hero Academia? What do you think, guys? I know that the one that everybody was searching for was Battle Deku. Uh, I think that was an exclusive, maybe. But I don't know much about it, so... Uh, it's still a cool pop, though. If I ever do watch it, I'll probably appreciate this pop. Uh, so, I'm going to put that right there. Hopefully turned that way. One, there's one more pop in here, though. Let's see which side is best. Here we go. <laughs> okay, that's another one. That's another one I know nothing about. Uh, Lord Boros from One Punch Man. Actually, I have been meaning to watch One Punch Man because I think it's on Netflix. Uh, I don't like watching subbed uh, animes because... I don't like watching subbed animes. I prefer the dubbed version so that I can hear it without reading it. Because uh, I don't watch TV to read. Know what I mean? Uh, okay, yeah, that's it. Uh, so that was it, guys. So I'm not going to pull up the values for these pops. You guys can look them up. There's Deku Training 
and Lord Boros. Two pops. One fig pin. These fig pins are actually pretty pricey. I think they're like ten or eleven dollars. Uh, so that's pretty cool to get in there. Uh, the Naruto socks, that's awesome, and a Sailor Moon Mystery Mini uh, that may be going to Caitlin at Funko Pops and Unicorns. Caitlin, just let me know if you want that. Um, so, guys, that is it from Ferreira. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I actually really liked this box. I don't know these pops, but it makes me want to go watch those animes. Um, should I watch either of these, guys? If you're familiar with them, let me know if they're good in the bottom uh, comment section, uh, One Punch Man and My Hero Academia. Uh, I was planning on watch watching One Punch Man. I hadn't really intended on watching Academia. I don't know why. I just really haven't. I haven't had a lot of interest in it. Uh, so, guys, the next thing I'm going to do here is, the guys, show you something that I got this week uh, from GameStop. I got my Gold Chrome Thor. Thor is my favorite Marvel character that's not an X-Man because I love the X-Men, but this is my favorite after the X-Men is Thor. Uh, this is a very, very cool gold chrome. And then I also was able to pick up, and I think I showed this on Instagram, but I haven't showed it on here, the flopped Hedwig from GameStop. Look, Hedwig, 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 Hedwig. Ours is flocked too, believe it or not. So there you go, guys. That's that. Let me... Uh, Turn this stuff this way so that there's definitely not a glare. All right. So let's move on to what you guys need to do to qualify for the 400 subscriber giveaway, which is this crocheted Hedwig from Harry Potter and the glow-in-the-dark Twinkie uh, Pop from Target, the Target-exclusive Twinkie Pop. Uh, let's see. As always, I'm going to try to use my platform to promote other channels, to try to help other channels reach goals. Uh, and I just messaged Funko Pops and Unicorns on, on Instagram. She's trying to help out Nerd Crew. Uh, if you haven't watched them, guys, you should be watching them. They're pretty great people, pretty fantastic videos. Uh, I really like them a lot. So I'm actually going to help her. I'm going to help her help them. We're going to try to get them to 200 subscribers, guys, between her and me. We should be able to do that, I hope, um, because they're not at 200, and I'm at 419 or 19 or 20, something like that. So if I if, if she can just get a little bit and I can just get a little bit over there, we'll get them to 200 subscribers, guys. Uh, I'm going to put a video uh, link in the description below for Nerd Crew. That is the video I want you to go to. You're going to hit hashtag homespun400, hashtag homespun400 in the comments of the video that I linked to in the description below, guys, okay? Go to that video, their video, not my video, not this video. Go to their video, comment, hashtag homespun400, and I'm going to give it a week. Today's Tuesday. I'm going to post this tomorrow, which is Wednesday, so let's say you're watching this on Wednesday. Uh, which is, what is tomorrow? Hold on. Let me look. Let me see. Uh, November 21st. Tomorrow's Wednesday, November 21st. We'll give it until the following Wednesday. What? Actually, you know what? Hold on. We'll do, we'll go until the following Tuesday at noon. So Tuesday the 27th at noon. Okay. Everybody has until Tuesday the 27th at noon to comment in the video that I link below. Hashtag Homespun400. Okay? Go do that, guys. And next Tuesday, I'll check it out. I'll try to film that video Tuesday night and Wednesday the next week, which is whatever day, uh, I will announce the winner of the giveaway for my 400 subscribers. So it's going to include this crochet headwig the glow-in-the-dark Twinkie Funko Pop, and I'm going to put two more things in there as well. Uh, maybe three. Probably three. I usually put five things in my giveaway. So, But the other things, I'm not going to say what they are. So you guys are just going to have to win it, get it, and find out. So, guys, uh, the last thing that I wanted to say here, guys, is I am at 419. My next giveaway after this will be at 500. My next big giveaway, I may do one or two between now and then. 
but my next big giveaway will be at 500 and this this beautiful beast right here this is a pop and it is going to be in my 500 subscriber giveaway okay just so you guys know this is a pop it's going to be in my subscriber giveaway at 500 okay uh, so obviously what you know here is that this is a six inch pop not a four inch so there will be a six inch pop in my subscriber giveaway when I hit 500 so guys that's pretty much all I wanted to say today uh, in this video I hopefully this video is not outrageously long because I know I did send some thank yous to Ferrera box giveaway so I don't know. I don't have anything else to say, guys. I hope everybody's having a fantastic Thanksgiving week. I hope everybody enjoys their meal tomorrow. Since I'm going to post this on Wednesday, Thanksgiving will be tomorrow. Uh, turkey and dressing, uh, whatever. Let me know what you're going to eat. If you're going to eat something different than turkey and dressing, the, the typical, traditional Thanksgiving meal, let me know. Because that interests me. So, uh, that's it, guys. I am Tylock. This is Homespun Geek, and I hope you all have a great day.